Don't blow yourself up, young man. You're apt to have a long night. Mr. Regal. Coming in early to help the ring crew, running the ropes while everyone else is still at the hotel, it makes an impression. Thanks. I do my best. Do you? What do you mean? Do you do your best? Apply yourself. You sound like my old math teacher. Well, you came to Raw more than a year ago now. And you've yet to make much of an impression. No titles, no great rivalries, a win-loss record with just enough victories to fly under the radar. A uh, great pep talk? Let me finish. I see your potential. The question is, if you're ready to fulfill it. I'm ready. Good, because as you know, there's a tournament for the WWE Universal Championship tonight. The final slot for Raw will be decided in a match on the kickoff show. One of the combatants will be Dominic Mysterio. That young man has a future, a legacy, a name. The other competitor is you. Thank you, sir. So much. I'll bring my best. Good man. See you do. You're the long shot of this whole night, my boy. You're the dark horse. Beat the odds.
Oh, good. There you are. I'm Troy Simpkin. Associate, but soon to be full-fledged producer. Uh, Troy, we've met several times. You even borrowed my toothbrush once. <laughs> Ribbing you, bro! Anyway, just wanted to make sure you had the lay of the land. I mean, you're already booked tonight, but normally these situations are a good chance. I've been on Raw for a while now. Okay, I... fine. Just trying to be helpful. Thanks, but I need to focus on my match. Good idea, since the kickoff show is starting soon. Oh, and I wanted to let you know that we won't be needing you for anything after the match, so feel free to head back to the hotel. Why would I go back to the hotel? I expect to win and keep fighting. Of course you do. Well, good luck. Well, look who it is. If it isn't SummerSlam's Dark Horse. That nickname is sticking. Good times. Good times? Is Raw trying to steal SmackDown's WWE Universal title? Between us, what is Regal really up to? Um, giving me an opportunity to win the WWE Universal Championship? He put you in a qualifying match. You think that's some kind of vote of confidence? Come on, don't be naive. I'm not. What are you getting at? You know he has all his royal eggs in the Cody Rhodes basket. He's just trying to set the American Nepo baby up to win. I'll tell you what, the draft starts tomorrow. You beat Dominic, maybe I bring you over to SmackDown in the supplemental. We'll make a big announcement on social media. Oh, you'll post about me? For real? Why would you want me in the tournament instead of Dom anyway? Because I want the WWE Universal title on my show, where it belongs. And I am 100% sure KO will beat you. Coming to SmackDown? Man, that is a very generous offer and a wicked smart strategy, Miz. I just... And I don't want to overstep here, but I have just one little thing I'm bumping on. What's that? It's just that I would rather have my fingernails pulled out with needle-nose pliers than ever work for an entitled, condescending reality show hack like you. I promise that you will regret that. Miz, this right now, this conversation, talking to you, that's what I regret. It's the so-called dark horse of the tournament. The following contest is a qualifying match for the Universal Championship Tournament! Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 245 pounds, Henry Virgil! Let's not get ahead of ourselves calling this guy the dark horse of the tournament. He's not even officially in it yet. I have to agree with you, Corey. Winning the WWE Universal Championship Tournament will be difficult enough, but to have to win an extra qualifying match first makes it nearly impossible. It's time to find out who will claim the final spot in the WWE Universal Championship Tournament.
The second generation superstar looking to carve his own path. It's Dominic Mysterio. And his opponent, representing the Judgment Day from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds, Dirty Dominic Mysterio. Dominic looks ready to go, but I've heard some rumblings backstage that he's not too thrilled about being placed in this qualifying match. Coming in complaining is the quickest way to sabotage your own chances. Dom needs to put aside his grievances and concentrate on the task at hand. One of these men will walk out of this qualifying match with a ticket to the WWE Universal Championship Tournament. And we know who it's gonna be, Cole. Dirty Dominic Mysterio. He's a hard man who did hard time. Hard time? He spent one night in jail. Show a little respect to Dominic's opponent. You really think this guy has got the stuff to follow in Roman Reigns' footsteps, Saxton? He's been called the Dark Horse for a reason. And a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. with the back fist. Tombstone maneuver coming. Wait, no. Lung blower. Wow. And shoulders are down. An easy kick out there. I suppose you have to take the shot, but it's still too early to wrap up this one just yet. Looking wobbly in the corner. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. <laughs> Rolling elbow. We. I don't know if Dominic can withstand much more of this. Dominic needs to reassert himself back in this match. Someone call a dentist. Is it enough? Staying in this one. Uh oh. About to hit. Rock bottom. Needed a midsection, and a kick to the back. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. And he continues to mount on the pressure. This is where the rubber meets the road. Can he keep it going? Kick! Oh, he's looking a little weary now. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Around it. Tombstone and route. Lung blower. Oh, what a four. Japanese on drag. Oh, there's some gouging going on. Oh, that's unnecessary. Able to get the advantage here. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Run by the clothesline out of nowhere. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. The body is starting to fail at this point. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Any more hits in that area. I have no idea what they're setting up for here. Oh, into an AA. Dominic in crisis mode. Needed a midsection and a kick to the back. Reflexes from Dominic. Spinning 
kick to the gut. And he's taking this to the outside now. Stop in the leg. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down, and, and a series of vicious stomps. Oh, kick right to the gut. All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 wiggles free from behind, chop block. Firm control. What a poop. And gets tossed back into the mat. Springboard elbow. Stopping their opponent. Ball by a forearm smash. Shoulders, attitude adjustment. If that's not it, I don't know what is. And he is saved by the ropes. And he sends him into the corner. On the second row. Corner in Zaguri. across the eyes. And they failed to hit the mark. Looking for a unique move here. Well, on their shoulders. Attitude adjustment. That's got to end it this time around. Two count. Oh, finally, monumental victory. Here is your winner, Henry we now know who will fill that final spot in the WWE Universal Championship Tournament. What a win. Impressive, but somehow he's going to have to find a way to string together three more victories before the night's over. There he is. Great match with Dominic out there. Regal made the right call opening that last slot up. We're in the opposite bracket, but I'm kind of hoping you make it to the final. Real Cinderella story.
Is that like some kind of reverse psychology mind game? Hell no. You make it to the final, I'm aiming to beat you just like I was going to beat Reigns. Is that right? Hope you make it to the finals with some nice, short, easy matches on the way. I want everyone to know I beat you at your best. That's the spirit. Good luck tonight, brother. Same to you. I'll see you in the main event in a few hours. KO, first round of the WWE Universal Title Tournament. Let's do this. Seriously? Are you literally the most desperate superstar on Raw? I'm just saying. Oh, KO, I'm so excited to fight you. What the hell have you ever done to even deserve being in the same room as the WWE Universal Championship? You want to know what I've done to get here? It was a rhetorical question. What you've done is take the opportunity to showcase your craft on the biggest stage in the world and flush it right down the toilet. You've been over on Raw for what, two years now? And most of the WWE Universe doesn't even know your name. All you are is some charity project for Regal. I'm nobody's project. Half right. You're definitely a nobody. See you out there.
Is that there like he is. some kind of hell? Is that right? That's Same to you. Okay, I'm just saying. Okay. You want to know? I'm no half right. He's back again to compete in the championship tournament. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from New York. Weighing in at 245 pounds, Henry Virgil! No disrespect to Dominic Mysterio, but the competition levels up a bit here with Kevin Owens. Yeah, it's one thing to take on KO fresh, but after already competing tonight? Good luck. It's almost time to see who advances and who goes home. Here comes the prize fighter. A man who always looks ready for a fight. And his opponent from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Owens has actually lightened up a bit. Has formed a few friendships in WWE. Yeah, but you have to believe those are temporary at best because fighting is all KO knows how to do. Since day one, it has been about one thing, fight Owens, fight. And the time to fight is just moments away. There were not many people who expected KO's opponent to make it into the WWE Universal Championship Tournament, but here he is. What do you think is going through his mind right now? This jerk in the curtain at SummerSlam is as close to the undisputed WWE Universal title as he's ever going to get. KO's about to turn Cinderella back into a pumpkin. Pretty sure that's the carriage, Corey. The odds might favor Kevin Owens, but we've already seen this man has brought his A-game tonight. Vicious right forearm. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh! And both athletes showing that they have each other's number. Kinshasa! He's feeling the effects of that last hit. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. KO is getting knocked around a bit. Owens needs to find an opening. Owens finally creates some more offense for himself. Owens showing it's not time for lying down, it's time for fighting back.
signature shot. Good grief. Nothing was being held back with each of those strikes. Oh, boy. He's talking him. Watching for an opening. Flick shot. Boom. With a forearm. On point. Unbelievable athleticism. Just going for it all and landing a direct hit. And now he's taken control. Yeah, he's found an effective form of attack. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Slang shot. Face buster! Off into the pin. Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. Keeping a loss at bay for now. Oh, the knee just being torn apart now. Just a step ahead of Owens. Hard impact on the back. Owens taking yet another punishing attack there. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. And he's able to counter. Momentum going back to Owens' corner. Could be a chance for Owens to change the complexion of this match. Owens into the ropes, but KO holds on. Kick to the gut. Stunner! Stunner! This one's over. Why the heck would he do that? I'll tell you why, Saxton. Kevin Owens is making a statement. This statement could cost Owens the WWE Universal Championship. KO needs to take the W. He's wasting time. It's not a waste of time. Everyone in this tournament is watching, and they see KO beating a guy so bad he can't stand up. Is he setting him up for another stunner? Wait, small package. One, two, three. He got him. KO had it won, but his arrogance Got the better of it. I don't buy it, Saxton. Let me see a replay. KO's taking it out on the referee. And another stunner from Owen. He might have won the match, but did this guy ever lose the war? Just a total meltdown from KO here tonight. And as a result of KO's meltdown, I'm not even sure his opponent's going to make it to his next match. Hey, I'm about to go live with a hit for the bump, and you are the guy everyone is talking about tonight. You got a quick sec? You got a bag of ice? 
Um, no. That is a bummer. But chatting with you is not. What do you want to know? You really came out of nowhere tonight with a couple of big wins that have you in the hunt for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. But I have to ask, is your performance tonight a fluke? I'm sorry? A fluke? I don't mean any offense, it's just... Your record hasn't exactly been at the WWE Universal Championship level since you got here. The only fluke is that I've been out here busting my butt for two years and it's taken them this long to give me the opportunity. What the WWE Universe is seeing is not a fluke. It's a guy telling each and every one of them, and you, it's about damn time. You did just take two stunners and win with a small package. That's not a fluke, Kayla. I call it strategy. I beat KO by outthinking KO. That sounds pretty egotistical coming from a guy who's about to face Braun Strowman in the semi-final match. The monster among men is going to do exactly what you and the rest of the WWE Universe are doing. Underestimating me. And that's why I'm fixing to win it all. Give him that on the bump. Somehow he keeps surviving. It's the Dark Horse. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York. Weighing in at 245 pounds, Henry Virgil! He's already strung together two victories tonight. Why not make it three? Why not? Because he's facing Braun Strowman. I don't think I need to say anything else. The monster of all monsters is here. And his opponent from Shiro's Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds, Braun Strowman. Strowman possesses jaw-dropping size and absolutely staggering power. And not shy about Guys. You are really beginning to see the wear and tear on the dark horse of the tournament. Despite the result, KO beat the hell out of him. And now he's walking into a fight with a genuine monster. A oh, bear hug, squeezing the breath out of him. It sits the... Oh, the bear hug. And a way to get out of it is being on display right here. Oh, what a clothesline. Look at all these boots to the face. Here comes a big one. See ya. Boom! Both wrists captured and man, knee strike. Now slingshot. Face buster. And into the count. He kicks out with authority. Don't know how he can't get more than a one count at this point. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. Now Strowman feeling the pressure. Braun is shockingly being dismantled. Wait for it. King shots up. Getting him into the corner. the cutter headed up he's thinking big perfect time
to attack when his guard is down. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. Saving us from having to sit through that. And he manages to kick out in one. Not getting a two count at this point has to be frustrating. Oh, by a forearm smash. position you want to be in right now. Huge talk. He can do it here. Kick out before the refs count. These men knew this match is going to be hard fought. Shoulder tackle. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. going to take. Strong counters through Strowman. Here he goes for the win. Quick shoulder up. This deep into the match and he's able to kick out before a one count. It's stunning. Hit with the cutter. And Strowman once again facing his competition's wrath. Yeah, and this long match is really taking its toll on Braun here. He has him right where he wants him. Oh my God, close line! A continuous attack on Strowman. Well, you don't often have your way with Brock. Top rope, measuring his opponent! For the win! Two! Got it, no, just a two! I am in shock. What's it gonna take to keep this guy down? Ow! Foot, meet, back. it right back. What a headbutt. The oh, Brown Strowman just powering his opponent up into the monster slam. Absolute destruction from Strowman. That's, that's impossible. I, I can't believe what we just saw. Strowman beside himself now. He saw this going down a whole lot differently like it has so many other times before. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. Looking for a unique move here. Well, on their shoulders. Oh, into an AA. That can be Strowman's demise. Shoulders down. That may be one of the biggest wins of his career. Here is your winner, Henry Virgo! Somehow, he has survived three matches and will advance to compete in the tournament finals against none other than Cody Rhodes. Just advancing this far is a huge accomplishment, but I'm sure the Dark Horse isn't satisfied yet.